What's going on future nurses and nurses? Cordero here with a couple of nurses. And today I'm gonna to be sharing with you guys a video that I recorded probably about a year ago on my MacBook, uh, just for me to practice. So I recorded the video for me to practice. I really didn't plan on even uploading this. Um, but as I was deleting videos and stuff, clearing up Rimmer on my laptop, I ran across it and uh, before I deleted it, I was like, you know what? Maybe they can find some value in it. Maybe they can use it if, uh, Maybe you guys can use it if you guys have a uh, trade care or just forgot how to do it or maybe have to do this at checkoffs. Um, so if you like the video, be sure to like, share, or subscribe. Write nurses rock in the bottom if you did find value or write any other comments because I love talking to you guys. Enjoy. Peace. Trade care. Come in. How are you doing? My name is Cord. I'm going to be your nurse today. How are you feeling right now? Okay. Confirm your name and date of birth, please. All right, thank you. All right, so the doctor's orders for us to do some inline suctioning. So we're going to um, get your tracheostomy suctioned, then we're going to do a little trach here to clean it up, okay? All right, before we get started, let me go ahead and get some of your vital signs. Okay, we got respiration rates. Respiration rate are about uh, 18 per minute, followed by a pulse of about 88. So let me get your blood pressure. We got your blood pressure at about 115 over 90, which is very good, or 115 over 72, which is pretty good. Have you had any problems breathing? Got a little bit of hard to breathe. Okay, well, let me listen to your breath sounds in your heart. Okay, bilateral breath sounds. Got the breath sounds sound clear. Do you have any allergies? Are you in any pain? Okay, so let's just get you lifted up here. Lift the patient's bed to make this cleaning easier for me. We're at regular suctioning for about, per doctor's order, which is about 70. I'm gonna get my suction kit opened up. This is a sterile procedure. Sterile filled. Filling my sterile filled. Taking my sodium water. I'm gonna use my sterile hand, which is gonna be my left hand. My right hand is dirty. Suction. Gonna make sure the suction is working. Suction shows to be working. All right, so this may feel a little bit uncomfortable, okay? So we're going to push in until we get to the carina. And intermittent suction on the way out. So uh, let patient cough and. Uh, Get rid of that discomfort. Um, if I believe suction is needed again, I'm gonna confirm that suction is working. So go in. All right, you're gonna feel a little uncomfortable, okay? So patient's coughing into the crina. Intermittent suction on the way up. And now the patient's has been suctioned. Both hands are now dirty. Stop my intermittent suctioning. All this would go to the trash. So are you feeling okay? Wasn't too bad, was it? And earlier I would have gotten the patient's O2 sets as well, um, just to monitor, have that monitored. We've done the inline suctioning. Now we're going to uh, do some cleaning here. So we're just gonna make sure that everything's looking okay. Is that okay? All right. All right and the only sterile part of this procedure is actually cleaning the inner cannula. What's up? <laughs> All right, we're just going to maintain our sterile field. Take the top of our measure All right, 
that she said no. Oh, okay. She came up, threw stuff down. I was like, whoa! No, and I was like, well, you threw your stuff down. She was like, what do you use? Sterile hand? Maybe you have to pull it really hard. Or if you do suctioning, and if it's not clipped in, it just comes out. So I'm saying, put, put your foot up there and be like, <laughs> you have this, this hydrogen peroxide. Mm -hmm. so we'll get this Could you send me the video? Sterile mm -hmm. hops are, yeah, of course. Clean. Sterile hydrogen peroxide. It's easier that way. <laughs> it didn't work that way. I'm gonna rotate and clean all the gunk out of it. This goes in the trash. Everything is now dirty. I can touch whatever. So we're gonna get those ties changed, okay? Let me know if you're uncomfortable during any time of this, alright? Oh, you're gonna get it. Gonna do some care around the hydrogen peroxide. I'm almost a little uncomfortable. I'm almost done. And of course, I'll make sure this is more secure, but these things are pretty trash. Okay, you feeling all right? Any difficulty breathing right now? Any yes. chest tightness? <laughs> I can't breathe. I can't breathe. Okay, so um, we're finished up. Uh, we're going to check back with you in a little bit to make sure everything's going okay. I would lower the bed, make sure one rail is down to make sure the patient is confined, place the call light, wash my hands, and document, and exit. Make sure you say not confined to the 